Hi guys, it's Lisa here. Hey, it's time for another Vintage Traveler's Notebook, video number seven. And I have a fun project today. Um, I've been digging through some of my pictures and I come up with a really cool little picture right here that I wanna use. I think that's really cute. We're gonna make a little mini book out of this. I think it's gonna be really cute. So. Let's go ahead and open up to where we are going to be working. As you know, this is where we've come with our flip out. And we have to do these pages too. So anyway, we're going to go ahead and do this page here. And I have an idea for this page. And um, I've saved some time by cutting and, and doing some inking before. So that I'm not going to be... Um, having to ink the edges on the whole time. So we're just gonna, I already pre-inked the edges. So. so what we're gonna do is we're gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and put this little pocket on and I cut it out of this paper. Let me show you the paper here. This is the paper that I'm using and I cut out some pieces out of this and this is the back of it. And so this is also what we're gonna be making the book out of too. This is the same paper, so, okay. And then, um, so I want to put this on here, and then I want to take this, this is the other side of it, and I just cut it in half like this. And I'm going to put this up here, and we're going to make a little hinge on here, so this opens up, and then our little book will be inside of here. It would be kind of cute. So. Okay, so anyways, let's get started, and let's go ahead, and I want to just glue, I'm going to clip the corner on this real quick. And then I want to glue this down on here. And I want to make sure that that's going to fit n nicely inside of here. And I want to make sure on this also that this is going to fit perfectly inside of here. So I'm going to trim this all the way up too. Like that. And so anyway, I want to go. What I want to do first is I want to just glue this on down here with my PVA glue. I had to change the tip on my glue bottle here. Make sure that it's it's working really good now. There we go. Okay, put this right down on here. Right there, I left some um, some some of the edges. I left a little. I, I left a space on each edge. Then put it right up to the, close to the edge. Okay, put that on there. Okay, and then this is going to be up here, and I'm going to make a my hinge. Here's my hinge, and I want to do it to where it's going to be folded this way. Okay, so I'm going to take it and I'm going to fold it up. I'm hoping this is right. If not, I'll have to flip it the other way. I have a hard time, like I was telling you, figuring out how things flip and stuff. It's hard for me to visualize it. So, and this is going to go, um, let's see here. Yeah. Yeah, this is going to go, let me see if this is what I want it to do. I think I want it to be on the inside. Put this on the inside. I'm going to glue it on the inside here. And then when I open it, see, I want to make sure that it's, yeah. I See, like like I said, i got to turn it the other way because it's not going to be right. Okay. And then that's going to open up like that. Okay. So I want to go ahead and glue this on the top of here. And I want to glue it with the fold on this edge and open up this side. Like we did, we did another one of these on one of my other ones we were doing. So I quite glue that right on this side. This right on the top. Okay, you see how we did that? Okay, and I'm gonna trim around it. Where this is rounded, I'm gonna just round it with my scissors. Quick. 
And then I'm going to just put this up here. And I'm going to glue that down on the top. Break it on how I want it to go. Glue it down. Okay, and I want it to be under that right there. Perfect. Perfect. There we go. And then I want to make sure it's glued down here. Yep, it is. It seems to be going kind of at an angle, but you know, you think that's going to be a big deal? I don't, I don't think it's going to be a big, that big of a deal. Okay. So, there we have it. It's kind of like we're making like a peekaboo spot here. So we're going to lift it up, and then we're going to make our book and put our book in here. So let's go ahead and close it, and then we'll, we'll make our book. So I'll set that aside. And this is our book front that we're going to be making here. And... We're going to be using this paper for this right here. Okay. So I'm going to fold this in half. Let me see how. I want to make sure it's going to be right where that picture is going to go. I don't want it to be too big. Because I want it to make sure it fits in that pocket. So make it like that. That'll be, that'll be perfect. Okay. Just gonna cut up here. All right, set that over there, and then I'm gonna come in here and I'm going to trim a little bit off the top here. Just like that, and then I open it up. This is the inside. It's really cute. I like it. So we're going to go ahead and glue this on the front of here. Because I think that is so cute. The picture is so cute. And I'm not going to round the corners. I'm just going to put it on just like it is. Just do a little bit of this this on the edge of this that's it that's it you guys i'm not gonna bore you guys with me inking this the whole entire time look i did last time the one thing i, I do not want to do is annoy you guys because I, I want you guys to come and watch my videos i do not want to annoy you and, and and have you go oh great she's inking again I'm just going to just do that. That's all I'm doing. That's all I'm going to do. All right. And now I picked out some of my pages. And here are my pages that I picked out for it. And I'm just going to just make a very thin book. It's going to be just four pages, you know. It's not going to be a big deal at all. So, but what I want to do is I want to take this here and tear the edges. I want it to be, I want there to be torn edges on some of my pages. And it does not have to be perfect. <laughs> okay, look at that. Um, and I'm going to ink my edges, of course. Sorry, sorry guys. I forgot I'm going to ink the edges of this. Because, you know, this, because you really need to do this because this really is going to stand out when I do it. So, I'm just going to do these two right here. And I can do any more. Okay, now see how that lays? It's really cute. All right, now I'm going to take this and put this on the inside of my book. Let's see. Yeah, like that. All right, and then I'm going to put it inside of here, inside of my book, and I'm going to staple it. I'm going to staple it with some staples right here on the side. And I 
want to do it on this side so that my, the outside of the staple is on here and not on the outside. So, go ahead and get out my stapler. Just staple. Put three staples in. There we go. Just a little bit crooked, but that's okay. That's okay. It's, just, it's a junk journal. Okay. And so, anyways, here's our book. Here's our book. Fold the pages. And that's what it does. Okay. That's our book. All right. Now, I'm going to put some lace on the edge of my book real quick. use this. Now we're going to glue it all the way around it. Wrap it around it. And glue it and cover up my staples. Okay. So what I want to do first is I want to put glue right where I want this to be. It's right on the edge. Careful on like so. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna use my Fabby Tack. My Fabby Tack. That's what I meant to do. So that this sticks very nicely and quickly. That's the best part about it. Okay. And then I want to turn it over and put the other, put this other side on the other side of my book. Alrighty. Put these on. Okay, looks good. Looks pretty good. I like it. Let's trim out the little top of this excess up there. Okay. And then we're gonna just this is done drying a little bit. We're gonna put this in the holder and make sure see how it's gonna fit in our in our holder. I'm holding hoping it's gonna fit nicely. There it is. Isn't that cute? I like it. Okay. I think what you know what I wasn't gonna round the corners, but I think I'm gonna I think I'm just gonna round the corners. I think I like it better. Just, um, I don't know. I have a thing about my corners being round for some darn, darn reason. I don't know why. And then this one, I wasn't gonna, but you guys, like you guys know, I change my mind whenever I, it seems like it, it always, I always seem to change my mind, you know, all the time. Okay. So anyway, here's our little book. <laughs> it came out, came out really cute. I like it. All right, and then we're going to see how it fits in. See how it fits in our pocket. Oh, and it fits. Yay, it fits. It fits, it fits. So it's, it's kind of like a peekaboo pocket where you just, you just go, Oh, hey, look in here. Here's a little book. Isn't this fun? You know? And I'm going to just go ahead and put that in there. And then put my flap down. And I think what I'll do to hold it, I think I'll just use, um, I don't know. Let me see. Let me see what I can use to hold it down with. Yeah. Or maybe like a, just, um, oh, I wonder if I should make a little. put something right in the middle and have it slide down. That is an idea. Let me see what I can do. Let me see if I got like a flower or something. Something we could put on there that would look really neat. I got these little 
flowers here. I think that might be kind of cool. I'll put that on there. And let's see here. I got um, yeah, I'm thinking about if I put it right here, then we could just put this, put the flap right under the flower to hold it down. Just like that. I think that's a great idea. And I'm gonna just glue just where these three are and leave the top open. Okay, Looks like this. Like that. See, and then that lifts up. Gonna make sure that that's gonna glue real good. Before, and then there's our book. I think that's really cute. I think it came out really, really cute. All right, and then just put it back under there. See? Like, just like that. I like it. I think it's nice. It's very cool. All right. And, you know, I wonder if I should put something on here. A picture or something. Some type of ephemera that has to do with something. You know? Let's see what I got here. Part of an old See if I can put a little picture on here too. A little picture or something on here. Okay, let's go ahead and ink it on. I mean, let's go ahead and uh, glue it on. This was actually a picture of a magazine. stuff I have. Maybe. Maybe a blue one would be good. Yeah, I got I think I got something right here. I think that looks good. Let's see if this cut it in. If I open it up, let's see if it kind of matches the book a little bit. Well, it kind of does. Yeah, it does kind of match the book. Okay. So let's go ahead and just glue this on. It matches the nautical theme, kind of, I think. There. Look at that. It looks really pretty. It looks really, really pretty. Okay. Now, I'm wondering down here if I should put... I need to put something down there, you know? I really do. Now, I know we got the doily on this page here, but how would the doily look if I put it on this page? And then when I opened it up, that would be what it would look like. That would be cute, wouldn't it? Alright, let's see. Now uh, this just goes like that. Now, I gotta be able to make sure that I can flip this the way that I need to flip it. Just like this. Because it's a, a flip out kind of page. So I'm wondering if I, if I put this on here, if it would be harder for me to flip out my pages if I had to, you know. And it might be. So let's try something different. It's a little bit too white. That's too white. Oh, and I got this. Ooh, which I use on everything. All right, perfect. Yes, I'm putting this on here. Perfect. 
Perfect. Oh, right now? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna put this right on here. Oh man, that looks good. I like it. I like it. Yes, I like it. Now let's make sure it flips like it's supposed to flip. Put that back under there. And let's see. It flips. It flips. It flips and it flips. All right. Oh, I love it. This looks good. Okay, guys. Well, thank you, guys. I think this is gonna be in for our our little um, project today. And uh, thank you, guys, for watching. And um, yeah, this this turned out really cute. I kind of like just came up with the idea today. I didn't really even have any idea of what I was gonna be doing, and it just came to me. And and this just came to me as I was doing it, of course. But yeah, this is this is like my my little peekaboo pocket. And here's our book, and it comes out, and there's our book, and we put the book back in, like that, and then we just seal it like that. So, so this is Vintage Traveler's Notebook number seven, and uh, that is it for today. And I will be back again to show you another um, Vintage Traveler's Notebook video number eight. And that video will probably be working on this page so we can we can finally get our little our flip out done. And then we can start um, on you know another page that we need to do. So. so anyway guys, thank you guys for watching and I appreciate all of your guys' um, comments and all of your, your thumbs ups and all that. And I just appreciate you guys so much. And um, so if you want if you would like, you could subscribe, you could you know do all those other things that I said. So, but anyway, it's great coming and bringing you guys these videos and I will see you guys either tomorrow or the next day with our, um, video number eight. And, um, but anyway, you guys have a great, great evening and I will talk to you later. Bye.